Hello guys, you're welcome again to another After Effects Tutorials and today in this quick tutorial I'm going to show you how you can create a snowfall or a snowflake depending on what you want to call it. We all know it's in the season of the winter season and most of the projects and some of the projects you might be handling in this season might require this snowfall just to depict the season of celebration for the Christmas. You can use this on a video, on a background, just for a logo reveal, text animation, whatever you want to create. So let's quickly get into it. So support me on this one. Do not forget to like the video, subscribe to the YouTube channel. Do not forget to turn on the notification, then come back. Let's get started. Now in Adobe After Effects, I have created a composition. Feel free to use your own setting. I'm going to do this on this image right here. You can just use Bing to Google the winter season in Germany and you'll get this image. So I just quickly created a keyframe, a scale keyframe across this. So I'm going to quickly start this. But you are going to be needing a PNG file like this one is snowflake png file drag and drop it into your project i got this using bing search and i got a very high resolution and you can do that to get this so drag and drop it into your project timeline and this is gonna be hidden we don't need to be we don't need that to be visible We're just gonna use it to texture our snowfall so right click on your timeline, go to new and create a new solid. We're going to name this fall or you can name it whatever. So hit OK. Add the CC particle world. We're going to expand the particles. And then we're going to set the particle type to textured disk. On the texture option, we're going to select the snowflake png that we just imported a while ago if you take a look at this now we now have our snowflake png as the particle that is being emitted from the cc particle world system you can use the yellow color and the red color here to change the color of the of the of the snowflakes but i'm not going to do that i'm simply going to add a fill or you can add a ramp if you want depending on the effect you are going to achieve I'm going to change the color for the fill effect so that I can see this very clearly. So I'm going to leave it at this white. So I'm going to go to the producer and increase the X radius and also increase the Y radius across the frame. Set the bed rate to 60, then change the longevity per second to 15. Reduce the bed size to 0.07, the depth size to 0.06. Expand the physics and change the animation type to 2 Change the velocity to 0.04. This is going to cause the snow to fall slowly. And we're going to change the gravity to 0.01 or 0.02. Any of the two can work. On the extra angle, we're going to change this to 0 by 45. With these settings, you can play around with it. And this is your snowfall or snowflakes. So you can then use this for a logo reveal or a text animation, depending on what you want to get. You can simply just add text to this. So this is how you can create a snowfall flakes in Adobe After Effects without the use of any third party plugin. If you learn something new on this video, please hit the like button. That will enable the algorithm to suggest this to more people. If you have any question, please feel free to ask me in the comment section and I'll reply to all questions as quick as I can. If you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. You can support me in any way. You can give me super thanks. Subscribe to my membership. Whatever way you want to support me with, even if you share the video, that is also a huge support and it is highly appreciated. If you like the video, leaving a comment is all a support. So in whatever way you are able to support me, I highly appreciate you. So until I see you again on the next one, my name is SSB Otaru from Motion Digit Studios.